Hello guys, Zuljin here and welcome back to another episode of Crashlands. I hope you guys are having an awesome day today. Guys, thank y'all so much for all the amazing support on the Crashlands series. As always, if you do enjoy the videos, make sure to give me some dap on that like button to show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. So this is a quest giver up here. Last time we found out we got to do a home wrecker mission, a choosing sides mission, and we still have to go visit our people over there that need the potions. So let's see. Rick, here's Rick Rule. Ah, I've heard rumors of new disordered in our bog. You are strange creatures indeed. I am Rick Rule, the, the looster of this roost. Looster, huh? I'm Juicebox and this is Flux. Pleasure. As time passes, the order changes. I will not be at the bottom forever. Maybe we can speed up that process. Perhaps. My fate is tied to Kroon's. As nestlings, we agree to move through the order together. Kroon has been struggling to rank swap with Chissix for some time. Until he does, so we cannot continue our ascent. Hmm. Hey Flux, what if we would have helped these two out instead? I didn't like that Chissix anyway. What would help us overtake Chissix? I must take this information to Kroon at once. Meet us at his his nest. All right, so I'm I'm guessing we picked a side. Are you sure that was a good idea, Juice Box? Nope. Let's go to Cruise. <laughs> we don't know if that was a good idea. Okay, so we can in fact go to I don't know where Cruise is. Ah, Cruise is right here. Okay, <laughs> let's see about it. Rickrule, Croon, These aliens disordered would like to help you rank swap with Chissix. I do not trust unsolicited offers of assistance. Alignment with this artist is an extremely rare opportunity, Kroon. They can take actions otherwise forbidden to us. Now hold on, we aren't looking to form an alliance or take sides in any brubbish politics. We're just looking for some information. Ah, you seek a favor. This is how it, this is now interesting. What is the information you desire? We followed someone here someone here, a giant headed jerk named Hukaduka, who stole my packages and we need to find them. Then we have a fair trade for your assistance in my rank swap with Chissix. Chickix. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying Chissix. Chickix. I will reveal any information I find. Deal. Now, can we make this rank swap happen? I have a plan. Plant Nerva all around the home of Chickix. His is the northeastern nest of the Ukrathanax. Uh, how would I do that? Brilliantly. Rubber's nest must be well preened neglected preening is a sign of disordered properties uh disordered priorities i guess seems harmless enough though i have no idea what nerva is bureaupedia bureaupedia says nerva or a star-shaped bog growth that can com wait communicate using electric signals those are the things that we need that new tool for that we don't have oh we've seen those but i don't know how to harvest them we have a tool that works well for harvesting nerva take it and chop down the nerva together with their seeds the ner they <laughs> then grow a nerva all around chistic's home in the northeast corner of our ukranax and make it look terrible they will take some time to sprout but once you plant them return to us when they are fully grown we could use the water bombs from the savannah to speed up their growth flux. Let's get to it. Okay, so we need to make water bombs too. So we got the, the schematic for the jack saw. Okay. Also, let's go to this place right here and finish up that quest line because we did make the potions for them. These are the things that I can harvest with that saw, by the way. All right. Oh, there's a fishing hole right here that I didn't notice. You need a better fishing pole. Ah, okay. So you can't even fish using that. Uh, oh, wait. I gotta go down to the right here. And plus, I can't, I can't deny this. It's too good. It's too good of an opportunity. When I can kill Avama without having to worry about the uh, fighting it. When it's just next to a jolly chomp like that, I just gotta do it. All right, here we go. Splashes Un with a potion, dumps one down Un's open beak, then unceremoniously chugs one himself. Ah, now that even tastes great. Who would have thought parasites could be delicious? <laughs> we must move soon. The bog is growing agitated with our presence. Where are you, you quadruple heading anyway? We are. We all had separate missions and were to rendezvous at a safe location. We're calling it Gram. <laughs> Wait. Grand Mama Pool. <laughs> Grand Mama Pool. Brickback should already be there. 
I'll give you the coordinates and we'll meet there. Whenever you make the journey, let's go, Un. All right, so we got that quest done. That's good. Now we can head home. All right, now we can check out the type of materials that we're going to need to make this new thing. Plus, we're going to have to make some water bombs, which do we have to make the fish and Mia for that? Okay, pearl scale. What are water bombs? These, there's a poison bombs, pearl scale anchor, pearl scale hover buddy stuff, turtles, turtle incubator, fish food, turtle barrel. These are beach balls, sea rope, flamethrower, nasty lure, Davy lamp, crystal kiln. I don't know where the water bombs are. Maybe it was at another station? Oh, but no, that's balloon clusters, squaps, and bot lamps. Uh, stuff glitopus. I don't know where these water bombs are, you guys. Sawgrass seed bombs. Oh, I wonder if you have to make that. Um, we might have to go back. Now, this is water, so technically we can do something with this. Let's see. Can we place. Let's place a few more floors here. All right, and we'll get rid of these walls. And we'll put walls. I need more floors, man. Let's see. More walls. I could put a wall right here. That'll keep it closed off. Okay, now I can at least get there. And didn't we have, it was some sort of fishing station, right? It was this, the water pump. Okay. Oh, it must be placed in Savannah water. Well, that doesn't do me any good then. Uh, let's see here. So if we go here, we can... I guess we could just place, you know what, I might not even have a, I might not even have enough floors to do this, I probably don't. Alright, let's sit down a few things, let's make some wood floors or something. I can make jolly floors too, but I hate to use that type of material for it. Let's see what kind of floors we can make, we'll go to the... Here we go, we can make some bone floors. Yeah, because we don't need any of this stuff. That'll be plenty of stuff right there. Just to start, and we'll come back for the rest. Tin will be fine. All right, now let's go back. Oh, I gotta harvest these things too. Dang, man, so much back and forth. Okay, so, wrong. Uh, if we were to set, I guess we could go back to where our ship was. Because there's no water around here, so. Alright, yeah, this is where all my, my water and holes were. Okay, so can I just place the water pump right here without floor? I sure can. Okay, and I can make water bombs. There we go. Uh, let's build a bunch of them. Also, can I go to... There's a turbo fishing spot. I'm just going to do this right quick while these things are crafting up. Uh, where is the turbo fishing shrine? It's like right here somewhere. Can I pick these up? No, I can't. Let's get the turbo fishing shrine. Okay, and now... I can go back to my place and I can fish right quick. This shouldn't take too long. The thing about Turbo Fishing Shrine is that it's like there's always a ton of stuff to hoist up so you don't have to waste too much time on waiting for like big things. Although when there are big that are readily available like that, I do take it. 
let's see how much stuff that we're getting just from just from a little bit of just from a few holes, you know. That's the turbo fishing shrine. Uh oh, that sucked. That was a good one. <laughs> that was real good. There we go. Yeah, that's the only way to fish, man. Probably one more. There we go. Now, that was a pretty good haul, huh? A bunch of stuff that I got from that. All right. Uh, also, do I need water balloons? I don't think I need water balloons for anything. Okay, we got a bunch of water bombs. What do we need to make? Oh, we need water balloons to make those, actually. We can build a few more. Yeah, they pretty much take one each. I don't know how many I'm going to need. That's the only reason I, uh... That's the, that's the only reason I'm doing it like this. Alright. One more. There we go. This is going to be plenty of water bombs. And that's it. Alright. I could come back and get those anytime I want. Alright, now let's see how we can harvest the um, the new stuff here. Uh, creeping Rift. I can actually press home just to go there too. Okay, let's trade sides. And now... I love these little quests, man. They're fun. A lot of thought went into them. All right. Let's get some floors just because we made them already. Just so because we'll need them around here and there. Oh, by the way, before I wait too long. Okay, and also, let's do... Let's make some more of those two. Oh, we can make six more? Don't mind if I do. Okay, um, what is this? Oh, fertile bl <laughs> blutch. This is like fertile dirt, but it's for the, um, it's for the bog. Okay, and the jack saw is going to take, what is this? Ah, okay, woe jacks. Those are those things that go in and out the ground. Uh, and this is going to need, yeah, we already know about that. We need some more of that essence. This is what, the tempered vama essence, okay. All right, so to get that, we're definitely going to need... Um, the only thing we're going to need, actually, is to get those Wojaks. All right, we could do that. Let's grab these. Place them. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. All right. Uh, that's Yeah, that's a pretty good setup right now. It's going to be pretty big. Okay. So now that I got that, all we need to do is get some Wojaks going, and to do that, I can possibly just... I can, I can go here, because there were some around here, right? Okay, yep, there are some Wojak Diglings right there. Yeah, aim's kind of bad there, uh... Vomit. <laughs> Ouch. Okay, that's four Wojak suckers. How many did I need again? Probably not that much. It's not that much damage, just a tank. Get out of here, Hookadooka. Yeah, you gotta admit, it's a lot faster. <laughs> it's a lot faster just taking the damage than the, uh... I like, I mean, I really do like the poison and fire method, but it's, uh, just a little bit slower. We'll actually kill some of these, too. Okay. 
There's another one of those guys. Yeah, come over here, away from that other guy. Okay. Give me turbo, baby. Give me turbo. Suckers hard to catch. There we go. Okay, I got Wojak Suckers 9. I think I only need like 10 or 15 or something like that, right? Yeah, come this way. He's not gonna come. That's one of those things right there. Oh, that's a... I think that's a regen shrine? Don't mind if I do. Uh, no, time warp. Oh, that's even better. And what is this? Oh, that's a regen. Okay. Hmm. That was a lot of free hits, man. A lot. Ouch. There we go. We got it anyway. Oh, that was two of those things. Cool. All right. I lost track of what we were doing. Yeah, we were killing these. <laughs> there we go. Wojak Sucker. I still didn't get any Wojak Suckers from that. These are all for potions that I'm going to need. Also, I wonder... Oh, yeah, that's going to be a pickaxe that we need for that. Alright. This is a big Wojak. I've never, I don't know if I ever fought one like this, but we'll see. I'm sure they hit freaking hard. I got turbo now, he's dead. It doesn't last long, but... Ouch. There we go. Okay, Wojak suckers thirteen. We'll do. We'll do one more. One more, and then that should be good. We'll pick this up too. All right. Got it. And I'll grab this just because it's easy to loot. Okay. Let's go back to... Okay. I was about to say, what? where are we going to? <laughs> we gotta go craft this thing. Okay. So I can make two more of these. Let me make the saw. That's what we needed. We actually had more than we needed, but that's okay. All right. So the saw. There we go. Yeah. Nice. So now we can harvest those things and we can get on with the quest. Also, what is this? Jolly signs. Aha. I'm going to go ahead and make this stuff too. Fertile blul blulch, blulch, a rich compound of bleh should work. <laughs> it's cultivating bog garden. Okay, so we'll be able to like grow trees and stuff, kind of like we did on the last biome. So if we were to place, let's place these first. Okay, that's our twelve of those. And uh, if we place flo, aha, so let's place it on this side right here. And we don't have anything else that we can place here. As far as plants go, uh, wait, 
Tiny Jolly Chomp appears to be a baby. Somehow work with their eyes when they reach adulthood. Makes no sense. It must work for them. Can we plant these? Oh, it must be... Oh, you can plant these. And I wonder if they make Jolly Chomps. That's interesting. Yeah, 15 minutes. Go ahead. All right, well... <laughs> Now we know what that stuff does. That's pretty cool. Well, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Next time we come back, we're going to play around with the new quests. I hope you all enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to give me some tap on that like button and show you support for the series, guys. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljin signing off, and we'll see you next time. Ooh. Why didn't y'all hit him? Suckers. Come back here. <laughs> Got him with the boomerang.